In this tutorial, I will show you how you can make a vibration sensor which you can use it with your Arduino in your projects. So let's see how you can make one along with its simple working principle. So without any further ado, let's get started. A vibration sensor is one of the most simple sensor you can possibly think of. It has one resistor whose value can be 10 kilo ohm and a spring like structure surrounding it. One end of the sensor is one lead of the resistor and the other end of the sensor is the spring. Second lead of the resistor is in the air, not connected anywhere. So if I connect one end of the sensor to the 5 volt and the other end to the digital pin of Arduino, every time there is a vibration, spring will vibrate and spring will touch the resistor. Hence we get 5V at the input of our Arduino. And that's the working principle of our vibration sensor, which is basically a simple switch. Now that we know how our sensor works, let's see how to make one. To make one you need enameled copper wire of 26 gauge. If you don't have one you can even use single stranded wire, it will work. Just remove the coating. Now measure about 25cm of copper wire and cut it to its length. After which we will use some sandpaper and a plier to remove the enameled coating from the copper wire, exposing the copper. Once that is done, use a bolt with 3mm diameter and make a spring of about 3 cm in length. After you are done making spring, you can chop off the one end of the spring and now take the 10 kilo ohm resistor and place it inside the spring just like this. Make sure it doesn't touch the copper spring. After that you can fix it in its place using some hot glue or two component adhesive. Now that is done, use some heat shrinking tube and cover the sensor and you are done. To test the sensor, I used an Arduino Nano. Simply solder one end to the 5V and the other end to the digital pin 2 of the Arduino. After which I wrote this simple code and as you can see, sensor is working flawlessly. So that's pretty much it for this video guys, make sure to subscribe and turn on the notification bell. I will be using this sensor in my upcoming project, so don't miss that. Until then, don't forget to hit that like button, share this video with your friends and subscribe for more awesome content like this and I will see you guys in the next one.